All right, so I'm filming and recording. So I'm testing the Ceramonic VM04 and the Tascam DR05X. <laughs> so all kinds of birds. Well, let's go look for them and record while walking. Um, if it looks like there's too much zoom, because I got the 55 millimeter telephoto lens for Canon APS-C. I don't know if you can hear me. It's a dog and a bird. Dogs and birds are traditionally great friends. <laughs> Just kidding. <laughs> okay. We don't want to get too close now. That's what the telephoto lens is for. So they see me now. <laughs> so can you read the signs? No fishing. Do not fish. Okay. Zoom is cool. <laughs> okay. Just testing the audio here, so the birds can't understand my speech. They're not intelligent enough, I don't think. <laughs> Should I put the standard lens in? See, on the separate audio track, you don't really know what I'm doing. So I'm holding Canon SL2 with the 55 to 250 zoom lens. And I actually got both microphones mounted on the cold shoe. So I can only plug one microphone into the camera. So I'm recording the video with the super cardioid unidirectional microphone. And I also have mounted the omnidirectional microphone, so I can record simultaneous audio unidirectionally and omnidirectionally. So that is cool. So we have two separate audio tracks, and if I don't like one, I could swap it out on the computer. Just like super cool. <laughs> you don't have to pick, oh, should I use a directional microphone or an omnidirectional microphone? Well, you can do both at the same time. And then pick and choose in editing. Okay, here's a babbling brook you can listen to for the audio. And I got the Tascam DR05X on automatic as well. I don't want to fiddle. I'm just my first time using it, so I don't really know what manual settings to use. Okay. So you want to try walking around the pond? Mm. Uh, I'm going to go the long way. There's mud. Okay. Let's walk this way. So now the microphone is pointing away. From the goose. Wah! 
Careful not to slip. So you got little butterflies. You see them in the video? It's like incredibly difficult. Let's see if we can zoom in. Oh my god, there you go. Look at that. Wow, that's crisp. That's nice. Uh, the autofocus is really struggling. Dang it. Is this when you want manual focus? There you go. Nope. Yeah. I don't know if I can switch it from autofocus to manual focus in the middle of the video. And I got it in smooth zone, not live point. So you go back up a little bit. Oh, so for the audio recording, I am trying to focus on a butterfly, but the autofocus isn't cooperating. Zoom back out. Okay. So that's facing the goose. Now I'm facing away from the goose. And see if you can hear the difference in the directional microphone. Okay, facing towards. Okay, I'm gonna try to walk around a bit here. Goosey Lucy. Uh oh. Doesn't like me. I should back up. That's why I have the telephoto lens. <laughs> well, autofocus is cooperating. Thank you, fence. So what kind of bird is this? If you know, post it in the comments on YouTube. I'm gonna they see me or smell me. So I'm gonna walk around. Okay. So you're not a good they're not following me. <laughs> see. They're not following me. Okay. Okay, so I've got a water fountain in front of me, and this thing is coming loose. It's not very stable. I'm gonna keep an eye on that. Okay, so that is, I'm recording, I'm facing towards the fountain. Okay, and now I'm gonna face away from the fountain. Okay, face towards the fountain again. So interesting, I know, you love watching this. Okay. Okay, so I'm just testing the directionality of the microphone. So you got an ant. See if we can put this vertical. Yes! So I was worried it was going to slip out, so it's pretty stable in there. Can you see the ants? It's a real wild animal there. Look at that thing go. Oh, it's gonna come towards my foot. Okay, there you go. Ant. So wild, you know, local wildlife here. Wild animals in the field. Uh, the autofocus hates this. There you go. The telephoto lens is pretty good though, huh? I'm standing up. I'm not even close to it. <laughs> okay. So I'm probably going to step on it now. <laughs> I, I can't see where it is. Um, okay. Oh, bug. 
What are these things? Butterflies? Okay. Ah, uh, so I think that's it. Let's... Uh-oh. It's following me. It's following me. Okay, so how, how do I get past it? Why is it following me? Please don't follow me. I'm going to gently walk past you. Okay? It wants food. Someone's been feeding it. Don't feed the wild animals. And then gently walk past you. And please don't follow me. Okay. <laughs> Alright. It's not following me anymore. This one doesn't like me either. Okay. Oh, so for the second audio track, if you don't know what's going on, is... There's geese. Um, it's a duck pond with geese. So, and this thing is heavy. The camera with the telephoto lens, the super cardioid microphone, and the omnidirectional recorder. So I got like two microphones on the cold shoe. So normally, you'd only use one microphone. And I got two on there, so it makes it heavier. Alright, so I think I can stop recording. Okay. I'm leaving the audio on, so I turned the video off. Because I want to find a woodpecker. If I see the woodpecker. I'll switch it back to video. Right now I'm recording omnidirectionally. But I'm not recording video with the super cardioid. Okay. Climbing a hill. <laughs> this thing is still recording. Recording for 13 minutes. All right. Okay. And see how the DR05X handles the handling noise. Car coming. Yeah. Right around here, where I saw the woodpecker the first time. I think it's up the hill though. I heard it earlier though. Yeah, if you hear me breathing, because I have to hold the camera up. So. Turn off the microphone if I'm not using it. So yeah, so if I was recording on the DR05X exclusively, I would want to put it on a shock mount to avoid any handling noise. Super cardioids on a shock mount. So. Can you hear that airplane? It's supposed to record everything, so. <laughs> I don't know if you can hear that airplane above me. There's trees above me, so it's actually, sound is coming through the trees. 
So I don't see no woodpeckers. Yeah, so if I was hand holding the recorder, it would probably be lower in my hand if I'm holding the camera up. What are these berries? Some kind of strange red berries. Word of caution if you see strange red berries in the forest, don't eat them. <laughs> you don't know what they are. Unless they're a botanist. Um, don't know what it is. Don't eat it. Probably poisonous. Yeah, I heard the woodpecker when I first arrived. That's not a woodpecker. Hoping you can get all this in the recording. Yeah, I've heard the woodpecker when I first arrived. Um, but I haven't heard it since. So. Probably have to get here like first thing in the morning before anyone else shows up. Okay, I'm going to climb one more hill <laughs> and then head back to the car. So I'm up on the road now, it's easier to walk on the pavement. And the micro the recorder is mounted sideways on the camera. It's a nice photo app, take a photo. So when you hear that ding, that's the GPS on the camera from the phone. A little bit overexposed and automatic. If it starts raining, I'll be upset. That's just leaves. <laughs> the wind. Why are the leaves coming off? It's not fall, it's summer. There's a lot of leaves falling. You can hear it, hopefully. Back up a little bit more. 55 millimeters here. <laughs> Alright. 
Well, I haven't heard the woodpecker at all. It's a very distinctive sound. Yeah, it's drilling into the tree. There it is. I just heard it. It's coming from back this way. I'm gonna go back down the hill. Follow the sound. Yeah, I supposedly have excellent hearing, so I can always hear these things. So if you can't hear the woodpecker, there it is, you hear it? If you can't hear the woodpecker on this thing, that's, the, that's no good. <laughs> there it is, you hear it? It's around somewhere. You hear it? on the video camera in case it pops out and microphone on so you can barely see the green light you know if the microphone's turned on or not okay and recording video okay so for people watching the video is we're looking for woodpeckers and I've been hearing it down here somewhere. You have to be quiet. You have to be really, really quiet to find the woodpecker. It's around here somewhere. See, so hearing it and seeing it are two different things. So, looking for woodpeckers. I think I hear it still coming from this way. How much wood could a woodpecker peck? <laughs> See, I don't know how sensitive this thing is. I can hear the woodpecker. I don't know if you can. Hear that? Tap, 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 tap. It's up there somewhere. I can't see it. Just gotta stand still, maybe. Gotta lean up, stand here under this tree. And if you see the woodpecker, oh, is that it? No, it's not it. I saw it, saw it once before. Remember, right? it's red. It's like a red crest. Whoa, that's a huge bird. What is that, like a hawk or something? It's kind of a giant bird gliding. Like a vulture or something, maybe. It's way above the trees. Had it for a second. Wait, there it is. Oh, fuck it. Damn autofocus. Manual. I 
I switched to the manual focus. I have the woodpecker. So this is where you want that um, Tamron 18 to 400. <laughs> so it'd be twice as um, big. It'd be impossible to hold still. It'd be way too heavy. I'm really struggling with just the microphones on here. To hold this thing still. Alright. So I think I'm losing focus a little bit. Is there a digital zoom? No, I think I have that disabled. Why does it say microphone off? I'm going to be upset if the microphone's not working. Just in case, I'm going to unplug this. Okay. In case the microphone's not working, I unplugged it. I'm recording it with the internal microphone now. I've been looking for this woodpecker for a while. If I sit down, I'll be able to hold this thing still. It's way too heavy. Oh, I lost it. I lost my angle. Uh, well, I got enough footage, I think. Try to find it again. If it's still up there. There it is. It's in one spot. Where are you? Depth of field is so shallow. That's really hurting my arms. Oh, wow. This is too heavy. Unless, um, <laughs> yeah, this thing is too heavy. I mean, I, I mean, it's fine walking around, but it's not moving. I could run to the car and grab the tripod, but probably fly away by then. Um, yeah, all this equipment on the cold shoe. I got like two microphones on there. Um, it's too heavy. It's not making much noise. I got like a swarm of gnats approaching me now. So I should probably um, try it one more time maybe. Well, I can check the audio. 
I think. Okay, so the microphone's working. You can probably hear myself. <laughs> so I'm recording the audio, second track audio. Okay, so I got the microphone turned back on. Woodpecker hasn't moved at all. I could go get the tripod. Um, we're going to try this again. And zoom out. Find Woodpecker. Zoom in. Focus manual. as good as it's going to get for focus. Okay, and then um, can we do digital zoom? Digital zoom is disabled. Digital zoom is disabled. Why? it's an automatic instead of but then I have to set my exposure and junk any interesting birds um yeah the woodpecker 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 yeah affiliated or I don't know <laughs> Yeah, I don't know how to enable the digital zoom. Okay, so we do this one more time. Okay. There's my little woodpecker. Is that? Did it fly away? All that time fiddling with the settings? Uh, looks like it's gone. I don't see it. Um, oh, it's just behind the leaf. I gotta move to the right. Okay. Okay, uh, try this one more time. I'm gonna hand hold it. Where is Pecker? Okay, we got it. Okay. How's our focus? This looks good. We got a photograph. I'm gonna turn that image review off.
right a little bit. Fly off, checking the focus up, up. That thing doesn't mind the noise at all. Yeah, I lost it. Zoom out. Where are you? It. So you don't know where to look unless it flew off already. I can't see it. Uh, well, I got photos and videos, so it should be good. And it's so I was worried because it said mic something off. Oh, Wi-Fi off maybe. It's not microphone off. It's Wi-Fi off. Oh, gnat went up my nose. Okay, I can't see it no more. That, um, whatever that was, drove by, scared it off, I guess. Finally. Okay, so we got some good sound tests here. Okay. So do one more video. Just a... Oops, I think I touched it from the recorder. Okay, and we're on automatic, manual focus. Go back to autofocus. And, yeah, I don't see it. Um, yeah, I think it flew off. All right. Do one more video here and record. Okay, so um, hopefully, as I'm doing a whole bunch of test videos here, hopefully you saw the woodpecker in the previous video and the audio worked on the woodpecker. See how good the super cardioid microphone is. I, one of the reasons I got it was to record wildlife. So. You know, I'm not, and I'm standing behind the camera when I'm talking. And if you're listening on the recorder, I'm standing behind the recorder while talking. For an omnidirectional recorder, not sure how it records if microphones aren't facing both directions. Looks like you got some bird nests up there in the trees. Uh, well, it feels like it's gonna rain or something. I'm just standing under the trees, maybe. Alright. Uh, I'm just gonna turn this off. And turn this off.